I guess my number one tip with going for a swim in the open water from a safety perspective and looking at the conditions and how you might even adapt your stroke is to make sure you go down there with somebody for your first time who does have the experience. So the classic thing to do is go down to the beach where you might have a lifeguard down there on the, on the beach side. Don't be afraid to ask them their opinion on what the conditions are looking like today. So it could be rough and choppy, you might understand that very clearly, but they might also have ideas on where the rip tides might be and how it might pull you off course, etc. So those things are very, very important because you don't want to get yourself into a dangerous situation when you're out there in the open water. But classically, when you're swimming out against the waves, think about shortening up your stroke and increasing the tempo of the stroke. Think about opening up the angle at the elbow and getting those arms coming up and over a little bit more so allowing you to actually keep that constant propulsion on, keep you moving forwards against the waves and the swell. Equally, if you turn around and come back and you're aware that the waves and swell are behind you, think about lengthening out your stroke a little bit more. So the number one thing really with open water swimming is all about being very versatile. Don't think you've got to maintain this one specific style of stroke. You need to know how to adapt it and change it. And that's one of the beauties. You might have spent all your life banging up and down the black line, getting a little bit bored with that. But open water swimming opens up so much more than that for you to learn how to adapt and become versatile with your swimming.